Trump once again spoke of his mission to repeal and replace the Affordable Care Act. He called for affordable child care and help for female entrepreneurs, as well as for an investment of federal resources for law enforcement across the country. What we've created is a movement, and it's a beautiful thing, Trump told his supporters. Trump also made a surprise announcement of his pick for Secretary of Defense during the rally, naming Marine General James Mattis as his choice for the position. The president-elect has slowly been rolling out his cabinet picks, with Mattis becoming the eighth person to be confirmed. Eight more positions remain unannounced, including Secretary of State and Secretary of Homeland Security. Further stops on Trump's victory tour have yet to be declared, though the president-elect's director of advance, George Kijikos, told reporters in November that the tour may take Trump to swing states we flipped over. Trump managed to win Michigan. Wisconsin, Pennsylvania and Florida, all states which Barack Obama won in both 2008 and 2012. Additional stops on the tour will be announced after the venues have been booked, according to officials cited by Bloomberg. Trump has repeatedly credited his pre-election rallies as being key to his win over Democratic candidate Hillary Clinton, in which he regularly drew tens of thousands of people to venues across the U.S.